Let's get busy. Yo! What's up, everybody? Cardboard Mose is what you're welcome. Uh, it's about that time. Full case, 2019 Top Series 1 Baseball Jumbo Full Case number 2. All right, as you can see, I got the teams on there. But who got the Yankees? Nobody got the Yankees. So, guess what? We got to random them, boys. Let's roll the die. The number one. I don't do ones or twos or threes because I'm weird. One plus ten is eleven, though. So, we're going to go eleven times in the random. I'm going to go ahead and grab everyone's name. Copy it. Come over to the random org situation. Boom. Paste it. Steve wants some Cubs loving. There you go. Asking early. I like that. All right. So, boom. We're going to go 11 times here. Here we go. Well, Michael Shaw, not for nothing, man. You know how it is these days, man. You know how it is these days. And the money shot eleven. What's up, Greg? Dude, right now that limited filler is uh, is null and void. Uh, I have folks that are buying into the break, so I'm gonna have to put a new filler together. All right, so we went eleven times. Kimmy G wins the uh, Yankees. Congratulations, Kim. There we go. Paste you there. Congrats. Put that there. Put that uh, there. And because this is going to be a hitless situation, I'm going to do it by teams. Makes my life a little bit easier. All right, I don't like how that looks up there. What's up, Wolfie? So, yeah, Greg, I would say uh, pick your teams up in the store, my man. I am giving away $100 tonight. Every break we fill comes with a hundred dollar giveaway so if you don't get a break i'm sorry if you don't get a hit in a break that you're in and meaning you don't get an autograph of 101 or a patch you could win up to a hundred dollars that's tonight only i can't stress that enough tonight only is that promo hundred dollars being given away to the hitless spots every break we fill tonight so let's take advantage people good luck everybody Boom. There you go, Kimmy. Kimmy getting a little luck. Let me, um... I'm working on sponsorships, Monster, if you want to holla at your boy. You know, the first ever sponsored breaker. That would be... Yo, that would be the shit. If I could get sponsored by, uh... By Nike and by Monster. That, that, would, that, would, that would, Those would be the sponsorships I would want. Or Red Bull. Red Bull's cool too. Or Nas. Nas is insane. Nas is like drinking jet, bull, jet fuel. Oh, JMS, trust. I would I would do no such thing. I haven't even eat I haven't even eaten the honey buns yet. That's how much I care about y'all. Red Bull's Red Bull's cool. When you mix it with vodka and a little bit of cranberry. Alright, as usual. J Mess. Come on, dog. C come come on. Come on. You ain't you ain't gonna be you ain't gonna be you ain't gonna be talking about your boy now. You ain't gonna be talking about your boy now. I don't play that. I don't play that. If you don't call me out, you better come correct. I'll send you one, JMS. I'll send you one. I know that's really what it is. I know you want one. I got you. I got you. All right. All right, here we go. What's good about this one is you get an auto and two relics in every box. Yeah, it definitely is Michael Shaw. <laughs> ah, 
It it's a Miami it's a it's a Cornerstone brand Cornerstone Cornerstone. <laughs> I didn't know that there was a name brand honey. What's a name brand honey bun? I, I didn't know that there was one. That's pretty funny. These these are the 2020 honey buns. They they ain't even come out yet. They ain't even came out yet. Exclusive to your boy. These are the 2020 honey buns, y'all boys. I love the jumbo version so much more. They pack like a thousand cards in one pack. And there's only ten packs to open. Sixers Warriors coming up here. About to tip off on TNT. Should be a good game. A potential finals matchup here. I'm interested to see Joel Embiid and Boogie Cousins go at it. Dude, if Ben Simmons ever gets... If Ben Simmons ever gets a jump shot, that boy going to be unstoppable. All right. Here we go. Good luck, everybody. So, the veteran base cards are not shipping. But I am on the lookout for the short prints and whatnot. I love uh, these. I kind of like these right here. Uh, Brad. Uh, you know the first one's free, my dude. You know, everybody gets the first one free. You know, if, if you want some, it's going to cost you, brother. Send me an email, Brad, and we'll talk. Jose Abreu for the White Sox. The uh, hat logo patch. That's pretty cool. I like the hat logo patch cards. There. Something like that, Scotty. Like they're either like in their warm ups, but yeah, you, I mean, you could tell. Like you, you could look at the front of the card and tell. Josh Hader, Brewers autograph. There you go. But yeah, they're they're usually like in their warm ups or something like that. They're they are not like in full on uniform. 
Like there's a short print of uh, Yari Molina where it's like a close up of, of him. Like you just see his eyes or something. Kind of creepy. Patch for the Giants, Buster Posey. So there are the hits White Sox, Brewers, and Giants. In hobby, there's about one uh, short print per box. I'm not sure if it's the same in in the jumbo version. That was a chrome for Sal Romano of the Reds. Sale Garcia, Chrome for the White Sox. Those are two Yankees there. The only way to truly know if it's a variation is to look at the back of the card. And for some of them, I find myself doing that. Steven Souza Jr., D backs Chrome. Let's get those limited football breaks filled while we do this, y'all. Let's take advantage of the $100 hit list giveaway tonight only. Jason is live tomorrow and Saturday. And his giveaways are different from mine. Jake Lamb, Chrome for the D-backs. The bait Ballpark Evolution cards are kind of cool. Well, limited three filled already, Matt. But we do have to work on four. We got four, five, six, seven, and eight in the store. Ideally, I'd like to get all of them broken tonight. But I know for a fact that we can do at least two. I know we can do at least two of those limited breaks tonight. I know it. It's still early. I got my monster, so I'm going to be up all night regardless. So let's take advantage of the hot hands, baby. Now, that's a code 15. I'm not sure what that is. Maybe it's an action pose or something. Yeti Molina, the Cardinals to 150. I know the base set is 10. Short prints are 67. And the super short prints are 68. So I got to look up what 15 is. Maybe like an action pose or something. Got 
got Michael Fulmer of the Tigers to 2019. Jaime Barria, Angels Chrome. Al K Line, the uh, reprint for the Tigers there. The reprints are pretty cool too. One down. Take a swig of this monster. Warrior Sixers game is good, man. Back and forth. Neither team could stop the other. It's going to be one of those games. Sounds about right, JMS. Sounds about right. We're trying to go quickly through it, though. Excuse me. There is the hat logo patch to 150 for the Astros, Alex Bregman. These are cool looking cards though. I dig it. Astros with a little hit right there. Albert Almora, Cubs 2019. Bo Jackson, uh, reprint. Got a random match. Ticket Dusant, Braves, Chrome. With the rookie. Put it with the rookie pile.
the hell's up with those piles? National Stadium to 2019. Eugenio Suarez, Red Chrome, the Ricky Henderson uh, reprint. It's the exact same card. What's the difference? It's the ex am I am I am I missing something here? This one's to one fifty, and this one's not even numbered. What what am I missing? It's got the same tops logo. Like, I don't, I don't get it. I guess maybe the... Oh, I'm stupid. The back of the card, there's like a description on this one. There's not on this one. Oh, that's interesting. Interesting, interesting. Yeah, it took me a while, Nate. <laughs> I was like, what? I was looking at the little things, and then, yeah, the back is different. Ooh, what the heck? An autographed rookie card redemption B. Okay. So I guess this needs to be randomed because that could be anybody. That could be anybody. There's no card number on this. So I'm going to random this thing amongst everyone. Yeah, I remember those, uh, the, like the third receiver in the draft or whatever the hell. I forgot what the uh, product was, but I do remember. I want to say Prism or something like that. Oh, Select. Never mind. Select, Select, Select. Vintage baseball card, so we gotta random this thing. Doesn't have uh, a team designation, so it's one autograph per box, two relics per box in this set. The jumbo, anyway. So the autograph was that redemption. We pulled a Bregman uh, hat logo patch so far. There should be one more relic in here.
Corey Kluber, Chrome for the Indians. These are both Brewers, yes. We have Yomo Sanchez, White Sox Chrome. Our Pujols Angels Relic. Who do y'all think is the best quarterback in this upcoming draft? A lot of people not very high on uh, Kyler Murray because of his height, basically. Jose Quintana, Cubs Chrome. Let me know who the best quarterback in the draft is so I can call the uh, I can call the Dolphins and make sure they draft them. Already got all these uh, base cards I need to move. All right, Michael Shaw, have a good night, man. Appreciate you. I did not, Steve. Good call. But I did not. Let's see. There was Angels. And Astros. So. What was the other one? A white sock. Yeah, we're good now. That other, the, uh, the autograph was a redemption. That doesn't go to any team. So I have to random this one. This was the autograph that came out of the second box. It's a redemption. 
doesn't have a team, so I gotta random it. Princess Garcia, Angel Scroll. Alright, got a relic up here. The medallion for Juan Soto of the Nationals. Something, something. Angel for the White Sox Chrome. Got a random that. A Bryce Harper Nationals patch. Porcello, Red Sox Chrome. Right, where's the autograph? The Nationals hit a Harper patch and a Juan Soto medallion. Pujols, rookie card, reprint. There's an autograph for the Brewers. So both autographs so far are for the Brewers. Travis Shaw right here. What are the odds?
David Price, Red Sox 2019, and a Suzuki rookie reprint. <coughs> Excuse me. What's today, Thursday? Yeah. Pablo Lopez, Marlins Chrome, Yankee Stadium, Evolution. Yeah, I like the ballpark cards. I like the Evolution cards, too. And the reprints. Starting running a running a space here with these base cards. Not make it work. Got the old school tops logo there for Trevor Bauer, the Indians. Let's go logo right there. Wade LeBlanc, Mariners 2019, Joey Votto Reds Chrome, alright we're halfway through, we need to make space for this. I hate that Joel Embiid shoots threes. So dumb.
Need to see something big time. Chase Anderson Brewers. 2019. Alright, JMS, have a good one, bro. Appreciate you. I'll see you Sunday. Remember, Sunday's gonna be an early uh, day. Super Bowl Sunday, we will not be live for the game. But we will knock out some eBay breaks in the afternoon. And see if we can get some store stuff ripped as well. Where are we at on that limited break? Last I checked, it was down to like 20. But I think we can feel that tonight. Uh, Tyler Flowers, Braves Chrome. Uh, baseball, Seth, I have no idea what you're talking about. Boom! We bet Red Sox medallion. Pretty sweet. This thing is heavy too, man. To 150. Very nice. Ah, you're one of those. Got it. Uh, baseball Seth, subscribe to these nuts. How about that one? Uh, bullet force gameplay what do you mean well this stuff is already sold my dude you like that one huh Eric yeah Cole Calhoun Angels 2019 Zach are Angels Chrome subscribe to these nuts <laughs> There's an autograph for the White Sox, Tim Anderson. Numbered to 150. Very nice. The White Sox already had a hit. Probably a patch or something. Now they got an autograph. There you go. Excuse me. I want to see a super short print or something in here. Sharpens are tough to come by. 
in the in the jumbo vari uh, variations. Well, Matt, uh, I got a little date tomorrow with this chick I used to fool around with. So we'll see what happens with that. Yasiel Puig of the Dodgers to seventy six. Hopefully, do a little golfing uh, tomorrow or Saturday. We shall see. But I don't really have anything planned. Probably just going to stay at home, chill. There's this new video game that came out that I bought earlier this week. So I'm probably going to spend a good amount of time playing that. What about you, my dude? Oh, there's also Super Bowl Sunday. Uh, I am going to be breaking on Sunday, but not during the game. Uh, a friend of mine is throwing a little party. So I do plan to get a little riggedy, riggedy wrecked on Sunday. Uh, Blake Parker, Angels Chrome. I play on the PlayStation 4. The only way to play, baby, on the PS4. But I really, really looking forward to going golfing. So much fun. Plus, I gotta, I gotta work on that handicap or whatever. Acuna, Braves Chrome. I want to get good enough so that by the end of the year, I can do a full 18 holes. <laughs> That's what she said. But uh, seriously, though, I would like to uh, actually go out and uh, play 18 holes. So far, I'm only on the range. So much respect to, to people that golf, man. That That's... It is tough, man. I, I thought it was easy. Like, oh, how, how hard can it be? Man, it is hard. Oh, dude, I've heard, I've heard of Battlefield. I've heard of it. Um, but I have not actually played it yet. It's funny you mentioned that because I... I've been wanting to play like a shooter, uh, a first-person shooter. I was debating picking up Call of Duty, but I don't know if I'm going to do that. Taekwon Walker, D-Bags Chrome. Chris Sale, Red Sox Relic. There's this game coming out later this year called Anthem. Or something like that. Might pick that up. It's like a, a shooter RPG kind of situation, which is right up my alley. I like playing single player games. I'm a loner, lone wolf. All right. I got two boxes left and a table full of base cards. Alrighty. I think I, you know, I think I do remember playing Battlefield, and if I'm not mistaken, it's like ultra realistic, right? Well, Matt, I am a huge nerd. I like playing role-playing games, and I've been waiting for this particular game to come out since I was in like middle school. It's a game called Kingdom Hearts 3. I've been playing it every day since it came out. But I'm going to get to really put in some work this weekend. I do not, I, I never played it on the original PlayStation, 
but I know it's it's one of the greatest games ever. I had the N64 when the first PlayStation came out. But it was due to games like Final Fantasy that, I, you know, when the ne next generation came around, instead of getting a GameCube or whatever, I, I asked for a PlayStation 2. The first ever Final Fantasy game I ever played was actually Final Fantasy X. And to this day, it remains one of my favorite games ever. That was the first video game that, like, legit made me cry. At the end, the ending to Final Fantasy X is, like, one of the biggest... Oh, my God. It's... it's You just... You don't see it coming. It's, it's ridiculous. I love that game so much. They're actually... I don't know if you know this. They're remaking Final Fantasy VII uh, for the PS4. You know, now that the, uh, you know, Square Enix, the same team that makes the Final Fantasy games, they made Kingdom Hearts 3 and the whole Kingdom Hearts series. Now that they're done with that, they're going to focus now on uh, finishing the remake for Final Fantasy 7. Oh my god. When that game comes out, whole oh shit. Elvis Andrus for the Rangers with the hat logo. I really like these hat logo patch cards. Boom. Oh dude, trust me man. I've 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 seen people play it. And believe you me. I am I'm actually waiting for the for the uh for the remake though, I ain't gonna lie. Speaking of remakes, I don't know if any, I don't know if uh for my gamers out there, for for those of you guys that had the PlayStation, you guys ever play Resident Evil? I'm sure you had to have played Resident Evil. It's only like one of the best PlayStation games, PlayStation series ever. They recently remade Resident Evil 2. And oh my god, it's freaking gorgeous. It looks good. It plays amazing. It's still scary as shit. Great fucking game. Ben Zobra's Cubs. Chrome. There's a lot of good games coming out this year, too, now that I think about it. Uh, Devil May Cry 5 is coming out later this year. That's one of the first games I had on the PlayStation 2. That series is a lot of fun. I'm low key, like I'm, I'm, I want, I'm actually, I'm saving money up to buy myself a Nintendo Switch. I didn't get, I didn't get a, I didn't buy myself a birthday present last year or a Christmas present. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna treat myself to a Nintendo Switch one of these days. Marcus Stroman Blue Jays. I'm going to buy two games. I'm going to buy the Zelda and, of course, Super Smash Brothers. Oh, dude, Scotty, I'm right there with you. Like, I can't play it, but I could watch somebody else play it all day, every day. Because I don't have a problem watching, like, a scary movie by myself. But if I'm with somebody else, you know, their reactions or whatever are what make me get, like, scary and whatnot, like, I don't know, I can't explain it. Like, if I'm playing by myself, I don't have a problem. Willie Calhoun, 2019 Rangers, Cody Allen, Indians Chrome. But yeah, lately what I've been doing is instead of actually playing video games... I'll just watch, like, there. there's YouTubers that record themselves playing the game or whatever. And what they'll do is they'll get, like, all the cutscenes. And they'll splice it all together to make, like, a movie out of the game. And that's what I do. Like, instead of just going out and buying the game and playing it for myself, I'd rather just watch, like, the three, four-hour edited version of all the cutscenes and boom. Yeah, I'll enjoy it that way. That's how I know I'm getting old. 
when I'd rather see somebody else play video games than play it myself. And I just get bored, man. I get bored. I don't have the uh, the attention span to sit there for hours and just play a game. I used to. Dude, I used to be able to put in stupid time on video games. I'd rather watch, like, something on Netflix, a movie or a documentary or something like that. Which is kind of sad. But that's why I'm looking forward to buying the Switch, because that Zelda game looks amazing. Richard Blyer for the Orioles to 67. I don't know how many of you guys uh, ha own the Nintendo Switch, but it's a really awesome freaking console. Yeah, dude, I'm, I'm right there with you, man. Same here, dude. I, Dude, oh my god. I used to do the same thing. I still do it. I ain't gonna lie. I still do it. I just don't have the patience to sit there and play a game for hours on end. Except Kingdom Hearts 3 has changed that for me. I've been waiting for that game to come out for over 10 years. So, I actually, that's for the first game in a long time that I've sat down and played for hours. With Merrifield Royals autograph. There you go. Yeah, dude. The, 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 let's see. The first, the first Kingdom Hearts 1 came out in 2000. I want to say 2004 or 2002. No, I think it was 2004 or 2003. And then the sequel, Kingdom Hearts 2, came out 2007 or 2006. So it's been more than 10 years. And they've been announcing it. They've been delaying it on and off. They skipped out, you know, the entire PS3 generation. And it came out just recently for the PS4, but it's 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 a it's an amazing game. Since you're familiar with Final Fantasy, Matt, it's uh, it's made by Square Enix, the same company that that makes the Final Fantasy games. And uh, what the heck is this? Bill James, who is the father of Saber Metrics? Interesting. I got a random that guy. So anyway. Uh, Kingdom Hearts is basically a mashup of Final Fantasy characters and Disney characters. I know it sounds crazy. What the hell? Final Fantasy and Disney characters. It sounds crazy. It sounds ridiculous. And yes, it is childish. But bro, the gameplay is so addictive. You basically, you're basically a superhero with a sword. And you go around beating people up with Donald and Goofy. Every now and then, Mickey Mouse joins in on the on, on the action, and all types of other different uh, Disney characters like Hercules and Tarzan and the Little Mermaid and so on and so. Forth. It's 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 such a good game. Stefan, it's funny you mentioned that. I was talking about that earlier. I kind of want to play like a shooting game, dude. The last time I played a shooting game was Black Ops Two. That was a while ago. Cool scooter getting out of the Reds. Chrome. Dude, man, if you if you like games like God of War, uh like fast paced action like that, you, you're gonna love Kingdom Hearts. It's it's more or less the same action. It's a it's an action RPG, non stop action. And you can it's it's a game that you can play with your kids and stuff. They're gonna be like, ooh, there's Disney characters, you know what I mean? Dustin Pedroia to 150 Red Sox. It's a lot of fun. It's a lot of fun. I like it. I actually can't wait to go home and play it. <laughs> but no, nah, man, I, I, I suck at shooting games now. I want to get back on it. They came, I think, what was it, Black Ops 3? I think they came out with Black Ops 3 for free on the PlayStation Network. 
a few months ago. I try to like always download those free games that they come out with because they're free. Why the hell not? Well, Stephen, I think you can drop a link, man. Drop a link for your boy. Daniel de los Santos, Phillies Chrome. Alright, almost done. The last box is upon us. Put on the red. I don't even know what put on the red light. I think somebody told me what it meant. Something about the ladies of the night getting ready to go to work or something like that. There you go, Stefan. I'll check it out, man. Hell yeah. No, well, not right now. Oh, he's playing Call of Duty 4. What's he playing? Oh, he's playing against people, I guess. I thought about making, you know, a, 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 a stream for gaming or something. But then I was like, man, nah, no. I don't even play games like that no more. Take a swig of this, uh, master. <laughs> Looks like your boy froze you up. Won that match. Last box mojo. Hopefully we still got some peeps in here. We're ready to put in some work on limited. Limited number four is down to 19. I think we can get that filled tonight. So, Stefan, let me ask you a question. Does he get paid to do that? I agree, Scotty. It's been uh, a bit of a snooze fest. Oh, nice. That's crazy. Video games turning into a sport. Why couldn't that be a thing when I was growing up playing video games? I'd be the greatest Mario Kart player ever. I'm still pretty good at Mario Kart. You guys ever play, uh, there's like a, there's a drinking game for Mario Kart. The rules are simple. You can't drink and drive, but you have to drink uh, your bottle or whatever before you cross the finish line. Harrison Bader Cardinals 2019. That's a cool looking card, these reprints, man. Ty Cobb with the Tigers there, super sweet looking card. 
Yeah, like my I have a little cousin that plays Fortnite, and he's trying to make money off of that. I got uh, another friend of mine who her little her his cousin she apparently gets paid to play uh, Call of Duty or some shit. And she's like 13. Charlie Black and Chrome for the Rockies. What do we have here? To 150, a medallion for Ichiro of the Mariners. There you go, a little something, something. Zach Grinky, Dvex 2019, Dwayne Underwood Jr. Cubs Chrome, so Bryce Harper might sign with the Padres, eh? Are the Padres even close to contending for a World Series? I don't know anything about baseball. I don't, I don't follow it. But I will be this year. Excuse me. There's an autograph for the Tigers. Nico Goodrum. I could use some good room myself. There you go, Tigers, an autograph right there. We got Mark him off here. It's only 11.40 a.m. Damn, it's early. What's that mean? It's like 8, 9 o'clock on the West Coast. Early as hell. Jay Bowers, Reeves, Chrome, Branch, Ricky. Who's this dude? A general manager. Hmm, I'm going to random him. I'll look it up on the checklist, see what they say, and go from there. Otherwise, I'll just random him. Amongst everybody.
Yeah, but then if you look at the back, there's also something about the Cardinals. Introduced the farm system with the Cardinals in the late 20s. So, I mean, I could random it between Dodgers and Cardinals according to that description. Or I can just look at the checklist and see what they say. So I'm trying to be organized here as much as I can. Let me pull that checklist up real quick since I'm almost done. Jensen, Blue Jays Chrome, Miguel Cabrera, man I miss those uniforms so much, the reprint for the Marlins rookie, Miggy Cabrera, Chris Bryant Cubs patch, a little sum sum for the Cubs, so LeBron did play today, I think, but they could have sort of just saw a highlight of his there on the TNT halftime report. Maybe my mind, my eyes playing tricks on me. All right, last tag mojo. See if we can get uh, something good here. Nick Birdie, Pirates Chrome. Finally, that's what we're doing for the break. All right. So with these cards, as you can see, there's a team on the left and on the right. So that's how I'm going to do this random. I'm just going to go ahead and random them either to the left team or the right team. Same as these right here. There's a team on the left and on the right. All right. Doesn't look like it, Steve. I mean, I went through them pretty pretty thoroughly. I do have them set aside here. I'll go through them again tonight, but I, I doubt it. Anyway, let's roll through this here. It's either going to go to the left side team or the right side team. If I roll an odd number, left side team. Even number, right side team. So odd left, even right. Here we go. Even. So these are going to be, this will be Red Sox. And this will be Angels. Let me make a note of that. That's Angels. And that is Red Sox. Boom. Now for these, 
If I have doubles, which I do, I'll give one to each team. And whatever's left over will go to the right side team. Because that's the one that won the uh, random there. Now I got a few cards that I have questions about. Uh, mainly these two here. Bill James, Branch, Ricky. I want to look up the checklist and see if they have a team designation. I mean, it's not a big deal, but I do want to make sure they go to the right spot. All right, so I'll do the old control F. Let's see. Branch Ricky insert goes to the Dodgers. So here, I'll put it on the screen so you can see ain't no funny business going down. All right, so you can see right there Branch Ricky the insert revolution of the game belongs to the Dodgers. So whoever said Dodgers, good call. There you go. Always got to refer to the checklist. All right. There's also Bill James. Who do you go to, sir? Bill James is under none. So we got to random him. As well as this uh, Equipment Evolution Baseball and the Rookie Redemption card. So I'm going to call, make a call here. And all these are going to be combined for one hit. Why? Because Uncle Jesse said so. Alright, so let's roll the die. 12 times in the random. I'm just going to grab all the teams here. Do the copy. Paste it there. We're going to go 12 times. Top team gets the uh, autograph rookie card redemption plus the vintage baseball and the Bill James insert. And the money shot 12. Boom, 12 times. The Mets are at the top of the list. So that's what it'll be. All right, so that's Mets. Bill James Mets. And the Redemption Mets. Done. Deal. So the Mets end up with a hit. Seeing as how the autograph rookie card is an uh, autograph rookie card. So there you go. Let's take this down. Come back here. Now let's do a recap of the hits. Well, these technically are not hits, but they are the only numbered cards we pulled. Or the ones that I noticed, anyway. Richard Blyer, Orioles, 67. Yasiel Puig, Dodgers, 76. Uh, Trevor Bauer for the Indians to 99. And Yadier Molina, the Cardinals, to 150. All right, relics. We have Chris Bryant of the Cubs, Ichiro Mariners to 150. Dustin Pedroia, 150 Red Sox. The hat logo patch for Elvis Andrus of the Rangers. Chris Sale, Red Sox. No problem, Steve. Thank you for joining the break, my dude. Mookie Betts, Red Sox medallion to 150. Bryce Harper of the Nationals with a patch. Juan Soto, Nationals medallion. Albert Pujols, Angels patch. Now, I wish I could have got you something nicer, Steve, like some ink or something, my man. We have uh, Alex Bregman to 150 Astros, the hat logo. Buster Posey, Giants patch. And the Jose Abreu, White Sox hat logo. All right. And last but not least, the autographs. So as you may have seen earlier, we hit an autograph rookie card redemption B. 
That doesn't have a team assignment, so we randomed it going to the Mets. All right. Autographs here. Nico Goodrum for the Tigers. Whit Merrifield Royals. Tim Anderson White Sox. Travis Shaw Brewers. And Josh Hader Brewers. So those were the hits. Now... To see who's gonna win some uh, some break credit here uh, tonight only. If you don't get a hit, you could win up to a hundred dollars in break credit in every break that we fill tonight. So let's see who's gonna win break credit here. I'm gonna split the break credit into four, so the top four spots will get twenty five each for a total of one hundred. And you could potentially win the whole hundred if you have enough spots to your name here. Let me see the Royals. I thought I marked the Royals off. I did not. Thank you, guys. Sorry, Kimmy. All right. Got that sorted. Copy. Come back into the randomizer. And we rolled 12 last time. Let's just keep it with that same number. So this is for the uh, hit list $100 giveaway. If uh, the top four spots will get 25 each. All right, here we go. So top four get $25 and break credit each. And the money shot 12. Boom. What the heck is this? We got Eric, the Reds. So Eric twice and Joe. What happened here? Random. They put the team put the teams there instead of the names at the bottom. That's not a big deal. I'll figure that out. So we got Eric's twice, the Reds owner, and Joe Pa. So if I come over here, who's got the reds? Eric does. So damn, Eric. Eric ends up winning 75. And then Joe Pa gets 25. Wow, so Eric damn near won the whole 100. So a, a little compensation there for you, if you will. For, unfortunately, did not get a hit, Eric. But you did win $75 in break credit.